In case you missed it, a WFMY News 2 viewer caught a Greensboro restaurant overcharging on the amount of sales tax. This right here is the receipt from the Taco Bell on Battleground Avenue, and it shows one item that was two bucks. And then it's going to show that the total was $2.23. What's going on here? Well, the sales tax should have been just 14 cents, but it wasn't. Two Wants to Know got in touch with the North Carolina Department of Revenue, and we went back to that Taco Bell location, bought the very same item, and confirmed, yes, the tax has been fixed, but who knows how long it was rung up the wrong way and how many people overpaid. When I posted the story on my Facebook page, it got 118 comments. Several issues were brought up, including, can a business charge me extra to use my credit card? And aren't all businesses required to allow me to pay in cash? Well, here's what the Federal Reserve says about having to take cash. The answer is on their frequently asked questions page. There is no federal statute mandating that a private business or person or an organization must accept currency or coins as payment. It goes on to say that private businesses are free to develop their own policies on whether to accept cash unless there is a state law which says otherwise. And our state doesn't have anything about that. Now, as for credit card processing fees, it is legal for a business to charge you for using your credit card. But the federal law stipulates that the surcharge that they're charging you cannot exceed 3%, which is how much a business pays to the credit card company for running your card. The business in this thing cannot make any profit. Now, businesses, last and for at least here, businesses can require cash only or card only.